Some things in life are just made to go together. Peanut butter and jelly, rock and roll, the sun and the moon. These things got Blake Sanders, the owner of KS Services, thinking. What can we pair with our superior heating and air service to make our customers even happier? Plumbing Experts by KS Services was born. So the next time you have a clog line, leaky faucet, or water running all through the house, know there's a reputable company out there on call just a click away. Call KS.com, your trusted source for heating and cooling and now plumbing. Good morning. This is your Weather Extreme video for Wednesday, June 19th, 2019. I'm meteorologist Scott Martin. We have the potential for some strong to severe storms later today and through the day on Thursday. Then a summertime pattern really starts to kick in with hot and muggy conditions throughout the weekend. More on that in just a moment. At 620 this morning, radar is showing only a few isolated showers over the west central and central parts of central Alabama, with a few light returns over the east central parts of the area. Nearly all of the rest of the area is dry at this point. Temperatures were in the lower to mid 70s across the area. Birmingham was at 73 degrees. Tuscaloosa was at 75 degrees and the cool spot was Sylacauga at 70 degrees. At this point we have no watches or advisories up for anyone across the area. We'll have to watch and see if this map will have any watches or advisories on it later tonight and throughout the day on Thursday. So on the day one severe weather outlook, the SPC has a slight risk for severe storms up for a good chunk of north central Alabama, mainly north of a line for, from Reform to West Jefferson to Bluntsville, while a marginal risk is up for the rest of the area north of a line from Utah to Thorsby to Davidson. Nearly all of north central Alabama is defined in a marginal risk on the day two outlook, and just a general thunderstorms are expected on the day three outlook valid on Friday. Now taking a look at the models, starting off with the 060 run of the GFS valid today at 1 p.m., we see that we'll have a deepening trough over the eastern half of the country with a low that will be developing and strengthening throughout the day today. We'll have a chance of scattered showers and thunderstorms across the area throughout the daytime hours with the higher chances stretching roughly from the I-65 corridor to the Alabama-Georgia state line. A few of the storms that developed this afternoon may become strong to marginally severe with the potential of isolated damaging wind gusts up to 60 miles per hour and some so small hail being the main threats. Daytime highs will be in the upper 80s to the lower 90s across the area. We'll have to watch for storms to move in from the west later today and through the overnight hours as we'll have an MCS sweeping through Mississippi. The high resolution NAM has the timing of it entering the state around the evening rush hour and reaching the I-65 corridor by 7 to 8 p.m. tonight. It will be in the process of weakening as it moves in and will break apart as it moves into the eastern half of the area. This is when we'll have a larger risk of damaging winds up to 60 miles per hour, especially in the slight risk locations. After that, there will be another complex of storms moving through the southeast but it looks to fall apart before really entering into the western parts of the area and is completely gone by sunrise on Thursday. Overnight lows will be in the lower to mid 70s. On Thursday the low really deepens and moves off to the northeast but it will be dragging a short wave through the area. This will provide enough dynamics that will have the potential for more strong to severe thunderstorms to develop across the area during the afternoon and into the evening and late night hours. Damaging wind gusts up to 60 miles per hour and hail up to golf ball size are possible. Afternoon highs will be in the mid 80s to the lower 90s. Ridging will start to build over the southeast and that will be pumping hot and humid air across central Alabama starting on Friday. We'll have the general summertime risk of a few scattered afternoon and evening showers and thunderstorms. Highs will be in the lower to mid 90s. Ridging strengthens throughout the weekend, keeping us hot and muggy across central Alabama. We'll really have to watch those heat index values as they will be above 100 degrees. We'll have plenty of sun with only a few clouds and a very small chance of a few isolated to scattered showers and storms on both days, with highs staying in the lower to mid 90s across the area. The ridge moves more toward the east coast for the start of next week which will bring an increase to our scattered shower and thunderstorm chances for Monday during the late afternoon and evening hours and again throughout the day on Tuesday. 
with skies ranging from mostly clear to partly cloudy. Highs will be in the upper 80s to the lower 90s on both days. That is all for your Weather Extreme video for today. We'll have notes on the blog throughout the day. Our next video will be out on Thursday morning, produced by me. This is meteorologist Scott Martin signing off for today. Have a great day, and God bless. Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no-interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today.